on this video and in today's video you're gonna come with me and go shopping for college school supplies. I was waiting to make this video because I was unsure if my college was going to let us go back or not. I do live in Florida so I had to be really cautious about like the number of COVID cases increasing and all of that but my school did come out and say that they are letting us come back. We have the option to do online school if we wish but I'm on a scholarship and my specific scholarship does not let me not come back. They said that we must go back to campus in person or else we will get that scholarship revoked from us. I really left at no choice. The scholarship is why I can afford to go to this school. It literally cuts my tuition in half and ultimately it's what I want to do anyways because I cannot study at my home. I feel like you guys might relate to this but when we had that period of time where we had to do online school like during March to the end of the May or whatever, it was not a good experience for me. Um, I had no Wi-Fi at my house and I had to go to my friend's house to get reliable Wi-Fi and do all my assignments so I need to go somewhere that can support me academically. I would much rather prefer to stay quarantined in my dorm room than to stay here and try to do school. So when I do go back in the fall, I'm gonna make sure that I'm following all of the, you know, the guidelines and staying in my room, not going out. I'm literally just gonna be going to my room, going to class, and that's it. Getting the essentials, you know, I probably go to like beach here and there where I can just like relax and go to the pool with my friends, but I won't be going out and I won't be like going in large groups like most of you guys are, you know? I just really wanna make sure that I get all the cleaning supplies that I need and get all the school stuff while I can while I'm over here at my home because on the other side of Florida, it's a really different world over there. They don't have a lot of stores stocked up and over here on my side of Florida, I feel like we have more cleaning supplies and all the stuff that you need. So I'm going to get all of that today. I'm gonna bring you guys along. We're gonna go see what I find and I'm so excited to start this process. So let's go to Target and let's go see what I find. A little outfit of the day for you guys. So I'm wearing this black bodysuit, my Levi's shorts that I got on sale for like $20. So and I'm also wearing these super cute pearl earrings that are little hoops. And I'm gonna throw on a little rain jacket because it looks like it's about to pour. So let's grab my jacket and head out the door. Did you guys like what I just did right there? That little rhyme? mask on and I put my hair back and put on my raincoat because it's pouring but I have an umbrella in the back so I'm going to get that and we're gonna go run inside These ones are great. So if you need a big textbook, get these little guys. These are pretty cute too. I'm gonna try it. It's like a flag and a highlighter. These are the best pens there is. Alrighty guys, so the second part of this video is going to be showing my haul from Target. I'm sorry if you hear like any thunder in the background. Um, it's raining, but I think it will be like going down. So I'm just going to show you guys. So the first thing I got is this Everspring multi-purpose cleaner. This is so perfect for cleaning any surface that you need to. This cleans glass, marble, counter, wood, anything. So this is really good and I really like it. This is in the scent Lemon and Mint. I got these succulent magnets for my fridge in my dorm because I got a fridge this year and a full kitchen So I can't wait to buy like all my kitchen supplies This is the first thing I got and I thought these would be really cute to hang things that are necessary I got 
got Expo markers for in the study rooms when I need to write on a whiteboard or even on my personal whiteboard. I got the multi-pack color with all the different ones so that when I'm studying I can like color and write things in different colors. This thick whiteout sticks are the best thing ever. They have saved my college career. These are the tape ones. If you don't have these, you need to get these. These are amazing for when you write in pen and you need to change something or I don't even know, but just you need these in college. The next thing I got is this pink five star um, folder. I got the folder because I like throwing in papers that my professors give me like the syllabuses and or syllabi, my bad, the syllabi and I put that in here. I also put a lot of other things I might need or like if I need to bring a presentation to class I'll put my notes in here so I just got one in pink. I got a college ruled notebook in pink as well and then I also got a five subject notebook. So the way I do things is I get a five subject notebook and I use it for all my classes because a lot of my classes are back to back and a lot of them aren't so I need to make sure that I have everything and if I don't have a lot of time like I only have 10 minutes to get in between class I want to make sure I have everything I need so it has just been so much more easier for me to get a five subject notebook and put all my subjects in here so that I don't have to put in binders and put in notebooks for every single class when I can just use this one and half the time like one subject well like one subject like biology may take up two of these but another class like composition will only take up two pages so this is why it's so good to have a five subject and you can just start at any of them and what the coolest thing about this one is you get to place where you want to put these and you can move them at any time so if you need more room you can like take it out and move it around which I think is so cool and I can't wait to use this new feature. I got a new planner because the one I have now is a little crowded and used up so I got this 20 to 21 calendar and it is just stripes with polka dots and it is super cute and I like the stickers in the front. They were really cute and I also like the way that the pages are laid out. So this is like the beginning of one for this month. It has a to-do list. It also has important dates, work goals, health goals, personal goals. And then if you turn the page, it has the calendar laid out, which is pretty nice. But then the best part is this week section laid out and then it has the days. So I think that's super cool. And it has to buy, to call, don't forget, and to do. So I really appreciate these little things because this is already stuff I'm putting in my planner. So it's really nice just having a section for it. The next thing I got is this magnetic cork board. Like, I don't know what these things are called. Letter board. <laughs> and my roommate had one last year and I thought it was so cute. This one's magnetic, so I could even put it on the fridge or I could hang it up in my room, whatever I decide. So I'm really excited and it comes with 145 letters. So that's really cool. The next thing I got, which I mentioned in the store, is these post-it notes. These are so helpful when you're studying. I got the paper ones because the plastic ones you can't write on unless you're using a Sharpie. And who has a Sharpie? Not me. So I use the paper ones. And then I also found these really cool post-it highlighters. They highlight and they have post-it notes. So while you're highlighting, you can mark a page if you need to. And there is my cat. The next thing I got is four of these pencils by Bic. These are my all-time favorite. I am left-handed, so I really look and see like how pens and pencils smear because that is a major issue in my life. So everything I do, I try to make it the most comfortable for my left hand. These are the best pencils by far. The erasers on these are fantastic. 10 out of 10, the best. And I like personally these ones. Um, I don't really like the other ones that are like uh, solid colors. I think the sparkle ones are the best brand. I also got these succulent push pins for my cork board. I thought these were really cute and they match the magnets. I got Mr. Clean Match erasers and a pack of seven. What a deal. Um, I can't wait to clean my dorm before I go in to it. I got a Tervis cup for my little, I'm starting to get like big little gifts. So if you guys want me to film that whole experience of me getting my little and crafting and creating for her, then comment down below and I would love to share that I'm going to do this cup and so many other things. I got this super cute pack of pens. This is by the brand U Brand. I never heard of them before, but they are eco-friendly and everything we use is plant-based. 
So that is awesome and amazing. And how cute are these pens? I mean, saving the environment and using cute school supplies. I got two packs of the 12 command strips because uh, you need command strips in college. And I also got this phone charger for my desk, which is wireless and you just like place your phone on it like the picture shows. And I don't know, I just thought it was really cute and would be a good little touch. I don't really know what you put on the side right here, but maybe I could put like my push pins or something. Um, that would be cute, just to like line up my little push pins and put them on the side of this wooden thing. That would be a good idea. The final thing I got is this bulletin board with a cork board attached. That's why I kept talking about push pins. Um, I thought this one was really cool because it says the days. Sunday, Monday, blah, blah, blah. But then I figured I could cut this in half and do like one week in the next week because all you really need to look at is two weeks at a time. You don't need to look at your whole month. That's just overwhelming. So I really liked how small this was. I can place this over my desk and it would just be so perfect and it has little hanging things right here. Command strips already attached. So that's amazing. Alrighty guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to me if you would like to. I would love for you guys to join my fam. We're on the road to a thousand, so please help me get there. Comment down below if you like this video and what you guys want to see next. See you guys in my next video. Bye guys.